You are about to begin your DynaSplint instructional video, but just a note before we start. Most of the time, DynaSplint systems are a rental product, and you are responsible to return it at the end of your treatment so that you're not charged for the replacement cost of the splint. When your doctor, therapist, and DynaSplint sales consultant agree that your treatment is complete, please view the simple How to Return Your DynaSplint video located at the bottom of this page, the shipping's prepaid, and your label's in the box. Now, let's get started. Congratulations, and thank you for choosing DynaSplint to help improve your range of motion. We hope this video is helpful as you apply, wear, and remove your DynaSplint systems. Thank you, and we hope to stretch beyond your expectations. When applying the neurological elbow extension DynaSplint, place the patient in a supine position. Stretch the arm out gently and open both front cuffs. Position patient's arm with thumb in the neutral or thumbs up position. The elbow cams should line up with the elbow with the struts going midline along the arm. Close the upper cuff. Bring the bottom of the splint up to meet the forearm and close the forearm strap. The strap should be drawn to the line marked by the sales consultant. Use the pillow to position the patient's arm in a gravity eliminated position slightly away from the body. To remove the elbow extension DynaSplint, unstrap both front cuffs and gently remove the patient's arm. Please reclose all straps and cuffs when the DynaSplint is not in use. The patient should be inactive and relaxed while wearing the DynaSplint. Start by having the patient wear the elbow extension DynaSplint for one to two hours. Build the wearing time up to four hours a day. When the patient is comfortable, the goal should be the splint worn for six to eight hours within each 24 hour period. After wearing, check for any swelling or red marks that do not go away after 30 minutes. If this occurs, or if you have any questions about the tension still addressing the tone of the elbow, please contact your DynaSplint representative. 